Hi everybody, welcome back to our channel. Today I am here with my son Jonathan. We are juicing. Um, yeah, the juice here at home only lasts us about two to three days. So I juice every two to three days. <laughs> every two to three days. Um, and we also love smoothies. Um, we will do... Uh, we will start doing also uh, content on smoothies. Um, so yeah, um, so today we are doing orange. We're doing two kinds. I always do two kinds. <laughs> so today we're doing orange, carrot, and ginger. That's it. Uh, we're not adding anything else. Just orange, apple, ah, orange, carrot, and ginger. Other combination we make, like the one that we just finished, mm -hmm. um, it was uh, carrot, apple, and ginger. That, that's the one that just finished. No, we, wasn't it carrot, apple, pineapple, and ginger? Oh, yeah. Carrot, apple, pineapple, and ginger. That's what we finished. Otherwise, sometimes we just do the... Other times we do carrot, uh, orange, pineapple, and ginger, and we leave the apple out, you know. And as for me, I also love my different kinds of green juices. Your cucumber. Last time I did cucumber and apple, and ginger and the last uh, otherwise i sometimes replace ginger with mint then i have my cucumber and apple and mint um and today i am making uh apple uh broccoli and lettuce and m ginger i'm not putting mint today so yeah some of you have asked um on the comments as to what um juicer i use I've always used DNA uh, cold press. I've never used any other juice. I don't know how others work. I don't have experience with any other kinds. Um, this is the one we've always used. This is our newest one. Our first old one has saved us for years and years and years. And uh, it, it came to a place where we had to actually replace it because one of these uh, sieves broke. You know, over time, that will happen. But trust me, but we, we would have, we used it for years. It, we used it for years. Um, so this one is a, is a, when we went and replaced the one we had, the old one we had, we didn't want to go look for something else because we love this machine. Um, we didn't even think twice at looking at other machines because we like this. But this was the newer one, the newer model compared to the old one we had. They had uh, done away with the old one we had because initially we were just going to go look for parts because this is the only thing that had broke, bro that, that was broken. One of the, because it comes with a few uh, of these. So one of them had broken. So initially we were just going to go look for parts. We tried to look on the, even on online for parts and we couldn't find find it. And when we went in, they said they discontinued it. So um, this was their newer model. And we've had this for years. You can say about over four or five years, over four or five years, we've had this one. So um, it's, we love it. That's why we're not changing it. <laughs> we love it. It does a great job. It juices. It's a cold press and you get a good amount of juice out of whatever it is you're going to press. Trust me, it's going to squeeze the life out of that fruit or vegetable that, um, yeah, that you'll be impressed and you'll be happy that you are not wasting anything away. Um, in case you're wondering, what do I do with the, what do you call it? The, the roughage that comes out or the, or, yeah, the, the pulp the pulp that comes out. With me, I throw it in my garden where I use it as a compost. I love it for my, for my garden, but I'm sure you can do a lot of things with it. I don't know what other people do with it, but for me, I use it in my garden. It's, it's great for compost. If I'm planting, I keep, I keep a whole lot of it in the fridge. I don't throw it away. And um, when I'm planting something or doing my garden, I, I dig up the soil and I put it in there and it does wonders for my garden. But nonetheless, I just thought, let me answer that because there's many who are asking, 
what do what juicer do you use there it is i use a dna and to be honest i've never used anything else so i won't be able to comment or to compare it to anything else all i know is i love it it has never given me issues that's why we went and bought we went and bought it again when we couldn't find a replacement with the old one when they discontinued the old one but nonetheless um yeah jonathan is gonna do the orange I don't know. Did you say hi? I've been hi. talking and talking. switching it off. Jonathan wants to add apple, um, so we're going to add apple, so it's going to be orange, apple, and carrot, and ginger, so yeah, we're going to quickly add apple, I'm using um, the pink ones for carrots, for carrots, for the carrot juice. So yeah, maybe you can let's let's empty up this juice. This is carrot. Should we put the um orange? And in? then we'll add the orange in. It's a liter of orange, I think. Okay. Then we'll add the carrot in. The our the carrot? I have the orange. This is the orange. Right. Adds a lot of juice. Nice. So this is two items in here, carrot and orange. 
Now he will do the apple. May start the machine and start putting the apple. Down. You press down. <laughs> Jonathan, you press it up. Oh. <laughs> Because of how you put in it. Here you go. Sorry? Um, where? It's filled. I mean, it's some button ones are stuck. You're putting too many at once. There's juice in here. It's okay. It's carrot. There you go. You need to give it a chance, Jennifer. <laughs> Just let it juice. You see? Funny. All right, there's the apple. We're done with the apple. Last one. The last apple. And now we're going to add ginger. That's a lot of apple. Then this is enough ginger. Woo! Yeah? Woo! There we go. We're done. We're done with this one. Now I'm going to do apple, broccoli, and lettuce. And ginger. So I usually start with with the with the carrot juice, and I end with the green juice because I don't mind, you know, continuing with the machine. Otherwise, if I start with the green juice, I have to wash it out um, and clean it up because they mind some of the stuff I put in my juice. Okay, there we go. So this is apple and ginger. Oh, that's gonna oh, last. Oh, it's gonna be yum. Let me get a glass for okay. me. Okay. So yeah, I'll put that in the in the jar once I'm done with that, with this one. Okay. Now let's do the green. Can you please pour for me? I'm gonna use the same. Mm, Jonathan, <laughs> I need to find a jar. And maybe if it is, if possible, because there's a bit of seed, a um, lot of Jonathan, can, seeds. Jonathan, can I finish my juice? Can I finish this and then we can do that now? Okay, because okay. you're asking me to do... Let's, let's just finish this. Okay. Then we can do that. I'm going to be here. it for you. I'm just going to be solving a few cubes. It's very nice. I love it. It's very filling. If you are in a hurry and you didn't have time to grab something to eat in the morning, it comes in handy. It's very filling. Well, that's if you don't sift out the, the roughage. Um, even if you do, um, it's still very, very filling. So um, I drink mine. Me and my husband, we don't sift ours. We love it with roughage. The kids, I have to make a bottle for them where, which is sifted. Um, so, yeah. Um, I don't, I never actually check how much of what I put in. I really go with whatever is there, whatever I have. Um, 
You know, that's what's beautiful about making your own juice at home. Um, you do it according to your liking. Now, if you are fussy or maybe you there's something you like more than the other, obviously you're going to put that more than whatever it is you're combining your juice with. Um, but if you love everything you're, 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 you're juicing with, uh, all the fruits and the veggies you're juicing with, I don't think... Yeah, you you will as the more and more you do it, the more and more you will come to a place where you where you know um, I like more of this or less of this or a balance of both or you know it's really to your liking. It's really to your liking. So I'm gonna do um, the green juice. We are done. Um, I'm going to sift uh, one of the carrot juice. That one bottle is sifted and one is not. Um, so yeah. So what we have here, as I said, it's orange, uh, apple because we decided to add apple, and carrot, and ginger. While it's doing that, I'm going to fill up the one jar. This is very sweet. It's very sweet and nice. Someone asked if do I add anything uh, to, you know, and obviously I'm sure the question was to make it sweet. Or you know, um, no, I don't add, I don't add sugar, I don't, I don't add anything. Um, depending on how you like your juice, 
Uh, you can use apple to sweeten it. Apple is always, for me, that's what I would use if you want to make it a bit sweeter because carrot on it, carrots on it on its own, it has some sweetness to it, but it's not very sweet. So, um, so if you want it to be sweet, um, I would add apple. Uh, pineapple also makes it nice and sweet. You know, there's fruits that will make, obviously, your juice <laughs> will give it that sweetness, you know. Um, yeah. So, but no, don't, I don't, then it defeats the whole purpose of it being healthy um, if we add sugar to it. So, if you want it sweeter, you just add your apple or pineapple or pear. You know, uh, your sweet fruits, you know, uh, because sometimes the orange might be, might not be as sweet. You know, you do get oranges that are not very sweet, um, you know. Just removing this. Actually, I should have shown you. Let's just put it here that you see. Can you see that roughage? It's like porridge. Now, I love it. I don't take it out. Um, but if you have kids like mine who don't like it, you just sift it out. That's all. There's nothing wrong with it. So, yeah, um, like I said earlier, uh, making your own will always um, um, will always be uh, great and wonderful in the sense that you decide what kind of juice you want, you decide what fruits you're going to use, you decide the taste you want, what must be more, what must be less. Um, yeah, it's, it's all up to you. It's really all up to you. I'm going to try and fill this up without using a jug. I don't know, I might make a big mess, but I'm gonna try not to. I'm still waiting for that one to finish sifting. <laughs> I'm gonna try not to make a big mess. <laughs> you know what this one smells like? It smells like broccoli and it tastes absolutely yummy. Yeah, there we go. This is my apple I use. You, if you notice, for, for all my green combinations of juices, I use green apple. Um, so here I've got green apple, lettuce, uh, broccoli, and uh, ginger. So, yeah. That's it. That's all. Hope I hope this has helped someone out there, um, you know, and answered some of your questions. Um, but yeah, it's been fun. Um, just gonna grab a glass. So uh, there's this much left in here. It's very nice, very nice. Mm -hmm. My son is asking for me to pour for him, which I will do. So yeah, that's it. Um, I hope, like I said, this has, this has answered some of your questions. Look forward to m more recipes on juicing and smoothies. We definitely gonna be doing smoothies. Summer is around the corner. Um, I love the fruits uh, in summer, um, your mangoes and you know and all that for smoothies. Um, we do a lot of juices in winter. Summer we we love our smoothies. Well, that's us. <laughs> that's us. And and maybe because of what is available fruit wise many times in the winter and. Um, with the kinds of fruits that are available in the winter, we prefer to make more juice than we make smoothies. Um, but look forward to smoothie recipes and 
and all that. And, and like I said, I'm going to, and, and more juice recipes, um, which we will do. Um, but anyway, it's been fun. Have yourself a beautiful day. Like I said, it's all to your, it's all to your liking. You don't need to follow this recipe. You don't need to follow, you don't even need to do this kind I'm making. You can go by the fruits you like and make your kind that you like and enjoy it. You know, that's what's beautiful about this whole thing. Anyway, it's been fun. Thank you so much for joining me. I mean, look at this. This is what gets left. This is the roughage that gets left. And I love this with my juice, obviously. On its own, it's not so yummy. <laughs> so I'm just going to fill up. This is for the kids. Just going to fill this up. And I'll continue to sift some more. Anyway, we are done. <laughs> Have yourself a beautiful day. It's been fun. Until next time, look forward to more recipes on juicing and um, bless you. <laughs>